The Narendra Modi government has now withdrawn the no-frisking privilege given to Robert Vadra at the airports across the country. The orders will now be sent to the Bureau of Civil Aviation Security for further action. Remember, there has been a lot of tussle and a lot of controversy over this particular move. Uh, and many were questioning the Narendra Modi government also uh, after uh, Robert Vadra continued to enjoy uh, the frisk-free status uh, even in this government. But now we are hearing that the government has withdrawn this no-frisking privilege uh, which was given to Robert Vadra at the airports across the country. The orders also, we are understanding, are going to be sent to the Bureau of Civil Aviation Security for further action. There had been also a post uh, on the social media, on Facebook in particular, by Robert Vadra, where he said that, I, I do not want these privileges. I'm ready to give them up. Uh, so what really has made the government uh, take that action? We will be connecting with our reporters in just a bit to get us more details as to how really uh, that has come uh, into force. But this is an important development that we are getting to you. Mother with us. Uh, for more details, yes, Madhav. Well, it just uh, as uh, recently as last evening, the Civil Aviation Minister Ashok Gajpati Raju had said, what business does uh, someone like uh, Mr. Uh, uh, Vadra have being on that list? He is a private individual and uh, clearly, of course, uh, it may have been something that may have been done by a previous government and this government is certainly really looking at it. Uh, also, in fact, uh, given the fact that Mr. Vadra had posted on Facebook saying that uh, he would want it to be removed and that he does not want this privilege, clearly, of course, Civil Aviation Minister yesterday had himself said that uh, why didn't he give this privilege up? when the previous regime was there. So clearly, of course, it's a hugely sensitive issue politically. We've seen even uh, Priyanka Gandhi make a statement on this entire issue in the past. And clearly, of course, uh, now uh, formally the BCS, has, uh, the Bureau of Civil Aviation Security, has issued a fresh list of those who are, will not have any frisking at airports. So while that has several important dignitaries and functionaries of the government as per the designations, uh, clearly Robert Vadra's name has been taken out of that list. So uh, this is something that uh, uh, since this new government had taken over was an issue. And now, of course, uh, finally, this, uh, uh, this is being confirmed that uh, this entire matter has finally, of course, uh, 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 the government has decided to take Robert Vata's name out of that particular list. And Madhav, as you rightly pointed out, it was Robert Vadra who himself had challenged the government to take away this no-frisking privilege. And even he engaged in a war of words, so I remember, with the civil aviation ministers here. Well, absolutely. In fact, uh, Robert Vadra, no stranger to controversy. And clearly, of course, uh, uh, as far as the entire allegation of VVIP privileges is concerned, certainly, of course, Robert Vadra uh, and his uh, privilege as far as no frisking at airports is concerned was uh, certainly something that was the issue of controversy in the past as well. In fact, uh, uh, clearly statements in the past had said that Priyanka Gandhi, had, uh, Priyanka Gandhi Vadra had all himself said that in the past that this was not something that had been asked for by either her, any member of her family, or by Robert Robert Vadra himself, but something that security agencies had in fact mandated, particularly because uh, when he travels with other VVIPs, certainly of course uh, these, uh, this protocol of privilege is given. But clearly, of course, this government has assessed the entire process. Where we have seen the civil aviation minister in the past also on record say that this matter had gone to the home ministry, and it's after the home ministry, ministry's advice on this entire matter that in fact the final decision by the civil aviation ministry was taken, because we must remember a lot of these uh, a lot of these privileges are given on the basis of various uh, security issues uh, that, they, uh, that may be concerned. So uh, clearly, of course, it's after the go-ahead that was given by the Ministry of Home Affairs that this final step has been taken by the Civil Aviation Ministry, particularly the Bureau of Civil Aviation Security, removing Robert Vadra's list there from that uh, uh, list of those uh, persons who would not be frisked at various airports.